What's up everybody? My name is Vince. Welcome to the channel. And you click this video because you're probably in the market for a whole saw set or a new arbor. And these 3 8 arbors, sometimes when you chuck them in the drill, they can become chewed up. And depending on the size of your hole saw, you might get a whole bunch of slipping. Here's the deal. There's a replacement arbor out there from Milwaukee that has what could be some hidden features built into it you might not even have noticed. And today, we're gonna talk about it. Man, maybe why you should take a closer look right after this message from our sponsor, VCG Construction. So what we have here is Milwaukee's 716 shank quick change hole saw arbor. It's product number 49569100. They're saying that this arbor can accommodate inch and a quarter to six and seven eighths hole saws. It's got a no wobble drive plate. We're gonna talk about that in a second. It does say minimum chuck size, half of an inch. So you're gonna wanna use this with nothing smaller. But there's a hidden feature you might not be aware of. And that's what makes this one unique and versatile. This is for use with quarter inch pilot bits. There's a couple of product numbers. You have your, your choice. I got my Yojimbo 2 from Spyderco. You know what's great about this knife? It's made right here by the good citizens of planet Earth. Love this knife. We have it out of the, the little package. We have the, the drive plate slides up and down our arbor and then what we have is our lock nut so let me show you how how this will work and you can see these o-rings these o-rings are literally so we can't back our nut off the arbor now if you needed to back your nut off the arbor you just take off the c-ring okay so we want to thread on to our hole saw now i'd like to back that off as much as possible i want to get plenty of threads into that hole saw Okay, then at this point, all we wanna do is push up our wobble-free plate, right? And then we're gonna lock down with our lock nut. We're gonna tighten it down, boom, hand tight, and we're, we're locked in place. Now, this is a great replacement, and it seems much more heavy duty than our standard arbor, and you'll see. There's not a whole lot of room in our half-inch chuck here, play-wise. That's why they, they suggest a, a minimum of a half-inch chuck. I mean, the, the arbor itself is 7 sixteenths. Here's the hidden feature that's built into this if you were looking for replacements, okay? I mean, th these are somewhat rebuildable, but if you were to snap off this end here, or if it's just rounded over so, so bad that you can't grip it anymore, okay, you might be in the market for a replacement. I personally, if I was looking for a replacement, I wouldn't necessarily go 7 16 and then chuck it into my half inch drill. I prefer the ability to use this with Milwaukee's quick lock system. So if you're wondering why they have these larger size arbors, okay, the quick lock system easily pops in and out of tools with quick lock. They're quick lock extensions. You can see how nice and tight it's popped in there. Here's the thing. These self-feeding switch blades, they're really fast drilling and they have, they're rebuildable and replaceable. The thing is, they're really, really expensive as well. A lot of times we're not able to get all the sizes we need. If you were to get this arbor for your whole saw kit, you can make a wide variety, a wide range of holes. And the best part is you can chuck the arbor in and out of the tool quickly. Did you know that? Did you know that this 7 16 arbor was made to work with quick lock? There's also quick lock on their 7 16 impact driver. I don't know if you've ever seen it before. It's a linesman's impact wrench but this all works together. If you're buying this arbor, you can also expand all of your quick lock accessories, the different lengths, different bits, 
We have the Arbor. You could use this with various whole soles. It's a expansive system that works all together with these quick lock enabled tools. And it's nice to see Milwaukee moving towards building systems, ecosystems around their tools, around their bits. Stuff is starting to work together. I like that. I wish they would do a little bit more maybe with their dust control, but one step at a time. Someone that roughs in, this is their dream. Some of you feel that it's a, a downfall of a uh, uh, this this whole hog to have this quick lock system you'd rather have just a keyed chuck and i could under i could totally understand that you're able to use bits that are not necessarily made for this tool it's it maybe would be more versatile but here's here's the big difference for someone that is in the ecosystem or willing to get into the ecosystem and invest Think about how much quicker it is swapping. Your job is to rough in all day, every day, and you're just swapping in and out from bit to bit to get the job done so that the mechanics could come in behind you and lay their pipe or run their wires, whatever. This is a dream tool. This is a time saver. That means it's a money maker because everyone knows time is money. And if you didn't know <laughs> that this stuff all works together and you just found out in this video, smash the like button. Also, leave it down in the comment section below. Do you use this Arbor? Do you use the Quick Lock system? Do you like it? Do you hate it? Are you now looking at the quick lock system in a different way because of this single accessory. We want to know. With that, I want to say I appreciate each and every one of you for being here. Thanks a lot, everybody. We'll see you all on the next one. Video's over, but I know you want more. So this is how you're going to get it. First thing you need to do is pretend you're this guy. And you're here at the birthplace of freedom. Now ring that bell like it's 1776 and let all notifications through. What? You're not subscribed yet? Smash this button here. After that, watch this video here, here, and maybe over here. See you later.